fact for Americans to know that have dietary issues. The food is very pure here in India and they do cook every day. Uh, maybe they'll get some street food once in a while, but um, where I've been, they cook every single day, even in the city. However, they don't eat salad. Like, they don't eat salad. Um, and they don't grow avocados here, and they don't <clears throat> import any food. And what uh, vegetables they do have, from my personal experience, they cook them to death. So all the nutrients are kind of washed away in my perspective, as well as they cover everything in turmeric. Now, I asked someone from India about that, and they said that's because that turmeric kills any impurities or toxins that might be in the food. Makes sense to me. That's why I've heard many Americans say, and myself now I've seen this, everything is all the same color. You are correct. It is all the same color. It's because they put turmeric in everything to kill any contaminants that might be in there. But they don't eat salad. Uh, the person that I spoke with said the only people that actually eat salad are people that are health conscious. And um, lettuce is not something that's here all the time. Uh, it's a seasonal thing. And uh, yeah, they don't eat salad here. If they do a salad, it's like cucumbers, tomatoes, and garbanzo beans with a ton of turmeric. So, also, for those of you that are gluten-free, good luck. Everything has wheat in it. Every single dish, like you get either pucha or chapate, uh, like, and I hope I said that right, probably didn't. It sounds an awful lot like ciabatta, which is Italian bread, but ciabatti is the Indian flatbread. And you get that with every single meal, three times a day. And we're not talking one piece, we're talking a stack every day, plus with rice. Now the rice obviously is gluten-free, but everything that is like a sweet or, you know, the breads are all made with wheat. Now it is not GMO wheat, but it's not gluten-free friendly. Be aware of that if you're coming to India and you have a dietary issues. Much love.